All right, good morning. This is your morning jolt. I'm Jacob Sonnenschein. And I'm Katherine Ross. All right, guys, it is earnings palooza. We had so many last night. We had Tesla, we had um, AMD. Tesla's up, AMD's down. We're probably going to see that throughout the day. Um, I was on Tesla's earnings call last night. I was tweeting up a storm, as I'm sure you guys saw. I will also be covering tonight, which is Amazon. Amazon, we have a live vlog run by Eric Johnson. He's great. Um, let's also talk about the stocks that are reporting tonight. We've got Amazon, we've got Alphabet, we've got Intel, and we've got Snap. All huge movers in the market. So let's see what's going on tonight. You know that we'll be covering it wall to wall. Um, and you know, I know that our Real Money reporter, Kevin Curate, has a lot to say on Amazon. Uh, we've been looking at Amazon and Alphabet's earnings since early this morning. Uh, we've been talking to the street. People are pretty optimistic on both. Uh, they've had a pretty miserable October so far, down double digits for both stocks. Um, but as we saw with Netflix, there is room for a comeback in the fangs. Um, we'll be looking at everything to do with Amazon today as it's a stock of the day, looking at uh, all of the growth engines that the company does have in cloud uh, and e-commerce, as well as some of the uh, caveats that it might have stemming from uh, Microsoft's uh, expansion into cloud, as well as some of the charges that they have coming from things like wage increases. So everything you need to know on the earnings release for both companies, which will be happening this afternoon from the West Coast-based uh, companies, um, and it'll be all on real money throughout the day. All right, so Amazon is also our stock of the day. You've just heard it from Kevin Curran, our real money reporter, who will be following it all day. What do you got to say about Amazon? Yeah, well, you know what Kevin's going to say, you know, the stock is down recently and analysts are pretty bullish uh, for the earnings report. A couple things though, an investor I was talking to said that Microsoft's slowdown in Azure revenue uh, could actually tip off uh, to us that, that the cloud computing market is slowing down a little bit. So when you look out for Amazon Web Services revenue, that could actually come down more than expected. That's another thing to look at. Another thing to look at is we know that $15 minimum wage at Amazon, is that going to put pressure on operating margins? It probably is. Another guy said, that I spoke to said, well, that actually could be really good news because it might mean that they're investing really heavily in their physical retail footprint. So that those are two really big things to look out for Amazon earnings. Analysts are expecting a beat. Even Kevin mentioned, you know, analysts are raising their price target ahead of earnings, but those two things, that $15 minimum wage, one operating margins and, and meaning that it could be they could be investing in retail space and two uh, the slowdown and possible slowdown in web services revenue two big things to look out for that's great all right guys amazon and alphabet are also action alerts plus names so when i interview jim kramer on the floor of the nyse live at 10 a.m which you can find on facebook we'll obviously be talking about those two names that's, what's up. That's what I got going on today. What do you got? Oh, I don't know. A lot of stuff. There's going to be a lot of stuff going on today. Duncan reported earnings, so I might do a little something on that, too. That's in my newsletter. You can check out that newsletter right now.